Oof. Hello everybody, welcome to the most fun game number 14. There's Down TV versus Chaos. Not good. Crimson Fox, I seem to know the name. I think he's a rowdy player. Oh well, yeah. It looks it, doesn't it? He hasn't even lost a game. 45 cars, 18 taken. I mean... Oh, God. Eight mighty blow. Three of them have claw. And this is one of those, probably one that's going to be and a dirty player. This is probably going to be one of those games. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen players. This is probably going to be one of those games where positioning doesn't matter whatsoever. And he's actually, okay, he's movement five, but blocks your hands is a, no, block leader, agility four. Fucking hell. Oh, man. I guess I've got to go babes just because I can't go fucking shitty ego. That's the thing. If it was a Chaos team, I'd go for, um... I'd go for an Apple, you know? If it was a normal team, I'd go for an Apple. I really hate that you can't go for a, um... You can't take an Apple with Nurgle, you know? I should have looked at my team. My team's like a proper team with, like, you know, block and tackle and stuff. But it's just simply not as effective as Mass Mighty Blow. I, like... It's pr that's what I thought was funny when like Lupak made his uh, his Suka Bliat team and implying that it was a dumb way to build a team. It's just sadly not. It's sadly not even a dumb way to build a team. It's it's a fucking good way to build a team. <laughs> it's an effective way to win just by claw clawing the fuck out of your opponents. And might be blowing the fuck out of your opponents. You know, it's actually a good way to win. Crimson Fox isn't a bad coach as well. I think I am. Um, I drew against him in UKBBL, didn't I? But then I got the riot to win. So. Right. I'll, I'll shut myself off now. I did not take a bribe because a bribe assumes that you're going to do all right. I took the babes. I never take a bribe. When I've got the choice between a bribe and an apple, I always take the apple because the bribe is just, you know, the, if things go well, you get to foul people. So I don't think you need a bribe. Um, whereas with if things go badly, you need you need babes or an apple. So I, I always plan for the... Um, Ah, oh, yeah, true, true, Pedro Jack, true. But I, I might be able to do that anyway. If I, I guess I'm gonna have to play my chaos a bit more. Um, like when I feel a bit better, maybe on Monday, hopefully, I'll, I'll do, you know, I'll do the whole snipe shield and um, don't know if I'll be spinning my chaos on my Nurgle and, you know, hopefully play a few more games. His record's eight six zero, which is pretty good. Pretty good to be fair. Right, what do I do? Blitz this one. Three dice in. I just two dice in. Three dice in. 
split him and two dice him. I don't fucking know. I'm not going to wish him good luck, I don't mean it, BLGF. What I don't like about this is, though, that they've got all the grass as well, you know. I'd, 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 I'd much prefer it if um, it wasn't grass all around. I think it looks a bit dumb, especially when you zoom out and you've got grass around this, you know, around this pitch, but never mind. Yeah, one time the only way to get squares exactly Miraz could do. I remember, I remember when it was... And uh, <laughs> and I, Crendora stripping was was streaming, and I was like, "You really need a grid." And then, and then and it was definitely stripping. It was actually definitely stripping. And he was like, "No, you don't." And I was like, "At a higher level, you do." And he's like, "No, no, 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 no. You don't need the grid at all." And it's like, "Oh my god!" <laughs> oh, that was pretty funny. He's going to make the dirty player foul, isn't he, on my dirty player? I didn't see that was a fucking GFI because all these fucking skills. Jesus Christ. Oh, fuck off, man. And the Astro Granite as well. Oh, Jesus Christ. Right, no more talking to chat or speaking and all. Rest of the match in silence. Holy fucking shit. Thank you. 
Well, I, I can't complain about the dice this game either, can I, so far?
No, I didn't see that guy was marked. <laughs> I've I've GFI'd by mistake and I've dodged by mistake so far this game. Which isn't great, is it? Great.
Few. All right, that was a good foul. Because I just don't have kill chaos. Um, I've got to hit this guy now, don't I? With three dice is nice. That was a great, great region, yeah. Now a cheeky 2D here. Got to do it, haven't I? Don't know if he can make it to cancel this assist. Yeah, he can. Kill him, maybe. Thing is, he's got 13 players, so... It should have been a blood agility for the leader. Yeah, I think so. No, no, no GFI, thanks to the good old Movement 7. Movement 7, is, is for this ball carry, has been amazing, to be fair. It has been absolutely amazing. Right, so obviously, get this guy off the pitch. And this guy. I mean, this this game has got a good chance of being a draw, I think. I'm not going to um, go out of my way to, um, you know... Try to well. I mean, I'm going to try to stop him, obviously. But I mean, he could easily bang on me, couldn't he? I really hate that with not having the the apple like for Nurgle. It is a pain in the ass because with other teams, you could um, you know, you could go ham, and then when you use your apple fucking change tactics but with Nurgle you don't really get that luxury do you yeah I don't think he cares about winning though I mean when you look at his build as he said he randomly he, he made it to grief um, funny thing is this team was just a fun grief team then I'm 8-6-0 so he's already drawn plenty of times I don't think he's going to care about it um, I'm going to make a cup of tea
Wow, very nice, um, very nice, Joey. I just couldn't get. Oh shit, Blitz! I wanted the Blitz second half, not now. Fuck. What a terrifying team that is, isn't it? Holy shit, no safe players to mark. Aguirre Weeks is correct, it will be chaffs like I promised. He's done pretty decent, Armadon. 860. 8-6-0. I had a much better look with Nurgle and Chaos than I did with um, Chaos Dwarves, to be fair. Oh, I don't get a blitz this time, eh? Piece of shit.
I mean that there, that there, that block was everything. What's what's good and bad about Claw Mighty Blow, isn't it? If you go, you know, he used the reroll, but if he if he had had block, he would have taken it and not done anything. But because he didn't have block, he actually made a Kaz. He would have never made that Kaz if he had block. So it's um, but obviously he's down a reroll. Not that he cares that much, I'm sure. I think he cared when he won in 81 to give up the score though, but you know, like it's, it's funny, it's a funny old game, isn't it? Well, at least he was sent off, but um, that's going to be tough to come back from, isn't it? Losing two players. But he lost one. So... I could base the ball carrier. <laughs> the classic base the ball carrier strat, if you can call it that. Um... That is the bad thing about not having block, though. Um, the camera is off because I just fucking feel ill, to be honest. it's I just feel ill. I, I'm saying try-harding, but it's, it's less try-harding and more feeling absolutely fucking awful. You can just come through here, can't you? So I need somebody, somebody decent to get banged on. He can make the dodge out. Astro Granite would be good if. It wasn't just plus one to um, GFIs, it was just every time you fell over it'd be alright, wouldn't it? He didn't lose a Chaos Warrior, no, he lost um, He lost the dirty player, then just a Beastman. I just blitzed a, be just blitzed a Beastman because, you know, there was somebody over there. You, well, I could have blitzed him, but I would have to put my guard in and GFI to hit him or something. Thank you, Inarian. Yeah, of course he was going to come round and... Well, I don't know. No, he shouldn't base him, should he? Can't. Just, I guess he's basing me because I've got guard, so he wants to take the guard away. But the thing is, I don't get to use my guard because if I would get to use my guard... Oh, well, unless unless he fails foul appearance for the first time ever. Yeah, he does. So that, unfortunately, is a brutal usage of the... Basing the guard there is brutal because I would have got the guard in there to two dice in. Wow, he re-rolled the, re the ugliness. Unbelievable, Jeff. He loves the greed rolls. He loves the greed rolls. Don't 
thank you, Aguero Weeks. You're a lovely chap. He's definitely getting blitzed now, isn't he? Right, he's just getting blocked. Don't need to think about that for a second. Good, give up a free block. I mean, it didn't do nothing. It did take up my... Um, it did occupy my... Dickhead for a turn, didn't it? Whatever the fuck he's called. Um, guard. Peace. I really want to fucking greed, re, greed re-roll that, but I, I just can't do it. Stops him getting hit by my blow. Greed is good. Greed is right. Greed works. At the moment, he's got a claw on this guy, hasn't he? He could dodge out to make that harder. Guess I want to have a bit more around this side in case he goes this way. I don't want to risk the dodge. Not not when he's stunned. I think if they were both. If he wasn't stunned, maybe I could have tried to dodge them both out or something. Both down on no all balls. Madman. Absolute madman. So now the question is whether to go for the ball or not, isn't it? Could put the guard in here, another player here, block him, then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Hit him. The bad thing is I'd have to tag him with somebody, or I'd just get claw mighty blood back. These guys all have to tag fucking things. It's just a bit horrible, isn't it? On the other hand, could just claw him, foul hit gang foul him, block these guys down anyway. I guess I'm going to block this guy down anyway, so I should just see what happens. I say block him down. Block him. A death! <laughs> Get banged on! My key could foul... Uh, what does he do? He just goes there. I guess that's okay. He could come in there. I guess I tag everybody. Oh, yeah! Oh, God. I love blood ball. Oh, yeah. Well, 
Where does he go? It's a question, isn't it? He's just shit that he's going to claw me and stuff. But if I get the armor break, it's alright, isn't it? Maybe I fucked up going for the ball here. Yeah, I guess I did. Get a good player blitz for like one of the very few times.
Oh fuck, I'm saying stuff and it's fucking, um, it's fucking muted. <laughs> See, Jimmy sees the game like the Matrix, it's just little ball and pals symbol, that's pretty funny. I <laughs> see more skulls than pals. Um, yeah, that was good. I mean, it wasn't, it was an easy sack, but on the other hand, um, I've been talking a lot, actually. Have I been muted all the time? Oh, fuck's sake. Um... Yeah, there was no way you could protect the ball, was there, really, in it? It was kind of an easy sack, but on the other hand, it had to be a pow. Um, if it just been a push, I couldn't have got through, could I? So, I needed a bit of luck. No, I know webcam today, my tiny life. Oh, fuck's sake. <laughs> yeah, I've been saying quite a lot. That's brilliant. <laughs> Thanks, Pedro Jack. Yeah, and he's still doing something here because he's stopping him dodging out and stuff, isn't he? Which is good. Um, right. I'd really like to um, block him into there and block him and then surf him, but I guess maybe I usually split him. One, two, three, four. That works out well, doesn't it? I have to knock down the um, claw guy. Also freeze him up. Unfortunately, a push kind of kills it either either direction here, doesn't it? I'll do it with him because I need to re-roll it if it's a failure. Oh well, fuck. Fuck. It's pretty annoying, isn't it? Yeah, I guess actually he should have blocked him then, and then he could have blocked him, and then I could have pushed that way, and then he could have gone for the pickup. But it's okay, he goes for the pickup, and then he covers with GFIs. Hmm, nah, he doesn't cover. No one covers. How many turns left? He's got two turns. He's down. He's up. He could just go there to base him. And then make the GFIs use the reroll. Yeah, okay. I 
And again, you know, I could have done them one at a time, but there's no point if you're gonna if you're gonna make them anyway. I couldn't dodge out Pedro Jack. No, no, I'm not gonna dodge away of a guy when I can just fucking two dice him. I had turns left, didn't I? Oh wow! <laughs> Get banged on. That is awesome. That's actually awesome. Right. Could, could have blitzed this guy, but what I want to do is foul his claw guy, don't I? Which I guess I don't have. But he, he can't do anything anyway. Right, so I only need to knock him down. He would go up to 29. I'd rather score on him, though. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, GFA. Do the GFI now. It's only 1 in 36. Right, fuck it. Do this GFI first. <sighs> Ring a stinger. Get this chap down. Perfect. Right, I think he's safe from everybody now. Let's go for the handoff. Yeah, the, the the block has been pretty value, hasn't it? To be honest. Very, very value. <laughs> yeah, the old I have block and you don't. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah, he has been he has been pretty unlucky. But I mean he hasn't got any block, has he? So he hasn't had any safe blocks. But yeah, he has been pretty unlucky, yeah. Overall he's got the worst dices. I mean he did that one in one in eighty one, didn't he, that was crucial. And um overall he's he's had the worst of the dices, absolutely. But then he did have the dicier team without having any block, did he? I mean he didn't have any reliability whatsoever. I mean that's the thing. It, it doesn't. It doesn't show that taking no block is pretty bad. It's just. It's just dicey. That's the thing, isn't it? I mean, on another day he could have just had the good dice and absolutely fucking ruined me. You know. Yeah, I'd, I had quad skulls. But I mean, he'd already had quad skulls, hadn't he? <laughs> so that made my quad skulls not so bad. Um, aha, he's for free because that was the. Um, Yep, zero, right, I can definitely have him. Good. 14 AV breaks to 8. And then 2 cars and 3 KOs. 4 cars and 3, I guess it was fair from twice as many. Yeah, that's true. Right. Oh, double. Could go dodge and have a utility beast. I don't mind a bludge bludge guarding beast. <sighs> That's interesting, isn't it? With a movement seven guy though, I mean he wants to be the ball carrier, doesn't he? Yeah, eleven 
Eleven two one indeed. Crazy record. Crazy record for Nurgle. Thing is, if I go dodge, he's not being a killer, and I really want the second killer. So it's whether I um. It's whether I take the dodge. Or go block, and build him as the second killer. Or whether to, you know, not. Over puffered. <laughs> um, oh, I don't know what to do with him. I'll think about it for the next video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.